Okay, this will be a final video on the set theory uh, video series. I, I figured that I just want to make one more video summarizing what we what I've covered in my set theory videos and what um what 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 does set theory have that can you know uh, contribute to the world you know in future applications. As I said, I was gonna make a video like this in my previous video on fuzzy sets. Well. You know, set theory is, as I said before, fundamental. It's, you know, regarded as, you know, like the basis for all mathematics as well as mathematical logic. It's um, also widely studied in mathematical philosophy. And, you know, it's, it's not totally a surprise because, you know, sets are pretty universal. You can put any object you want into a set and analyze it. I mean, that's what set theory is all about. Um, as for fuzzy sets, I think personally fuzzy sets will have more applications because... As I said before, fuzzy sets are, you know, they use sort of like random, they can use random data. Like, you can make maybe statistical algorithms, um, I mean, for, for cars, maybe. Like, if you want to have a car, like, it takes, like, you know, an average speed that you go and maybe, like, you know, factors in some sort of, you know, statistical formula. And, you know, tell it, it knows exactly how fast it should be braking or something like that. And then, of course, there are, you know, many other ways you can, you know, use this. Maybe in economics, uh... I would obviously imagine stuff for science, like maybe you have like an uh, artificial uh, agent, you know, AI, and it's, you know, trying to, you know, find the best decision out of a lot of other good decisions, sort of like in a chess game, maybe. Well, maybe it's not the best example because chess computers are pretty advanced, but just in general, like what, what, how will it, re how will it, uh, you know, analyze limited information to make the best decision that could be an application of, you know, fuzzy logic. And um, yeah, I think that's a going forward that's probably what fuzzy set theory will be you know um used used for and it's just set theory in general uh ro robotics would obviously benefit from it programming languages are all you know based on mathematics so and set theory is fundamental so i would imagine program maybe these programming languages get more advanced i would imagine you know s you know breakthroughs in set theory will help do that and of course well obviously computer science is based on math well m they well they computer science uh, the very you know foundations of computation uh, are based on mathematics and that's actually my next video series the theory of computation it'll probably be it'll be a lot longer than the set theory video because I've studied it more extensively and it's you know a pretty broad topic what can be you know the theory of computation is just you know all the math it's basically theoretical computer science uh, not not in, in entirety because that's itself even broader but anyways I thought this was a good video to you know wrap up the uh, set set theory video series Again, you know, we covered, you know, union intersection, talked a little bit about the continuum hypothesis, and there's other stuff to study in set theory, such as um, naive set theory, obviously fuzzy set theory, and really applications of it probably should be studied in depth. It's also used in uh, topology, which is like a study of like spaces and like, you know, objects and how they fold in like certain, you know, under certain conditions. And um, so that that I think is what set theory holds. It's you know pre pretty important in my view. I mean, feel free to disagree and you know post comments to you what your views of set theory are. But I think it's a good summary and a good wrap up of the video series. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and I will be you know making my next video on the theory of computation shortly. And maybe after that I might do a video series on Tekken Six. It's a you know really awesome fighting game that you know some people a lot of people play. Seen a lot of cool videos for it. anyone who likes the game should. You know, it's a it's a very fun game. I didn't really enjoy the Tekken series too much until the sixth one came out. It's pre it's pretty fun. I'll make a couple of video series on you know some moves and things like that. But that that again, this channel will be diverse. You know, math, science, and uh, obviously, and then there's you know be Tekken, you know, fu video games and a few other a few other cool things that I just haven't decided completely on yet. But it'll, my goal for this channel is to make it diverse and um widely you know as it's um it'll be you it, it can be viewed by many people for many different reasons and i just that's the general idea of the youtube channel all right i hope you guys enjoyed i think i may have r rambled on a bit um all right so see you guys later hope you enjoyed and uh thanks for watching the video on set theory that's all for now